where you first come in. Oh, you know, that's what that was. Yeah, okay. that's like the rest of the tournament. Nice. Nice. How many different games do you play? Like I in general. Play, I try to be at least competent at every fighting game that's besides K, besides Killer Instinct, King of Fighters, and Mortal Kombat. All right. I play pretty much everything else. Nice. Uh, Guilty Gear, Blaze Blue, Skull Girls, Marvel 3, uh, Street Fighter, DOA, Tekken. How on Smash, earth do you manage Smash. all that? Um, the best part is that when you've been playing as long as I have, because I've been playing a long time, yeah. when you play long enough, you learn new games. Every yeah. time you learn a new game, it makes it easier to learn the next game you play. All right. Yeah, that makes sense. Because eventually you get to a point where spacing and timing and fundamentals and reading all Just transfer. transfers. Yeah. Explains why you play Ganondorf. Yeah, because my hands aren't fast enough to play this game. I'm not a technical player. I just like Fun pay news. attention. Yeah, I play. I watch my spacing and I pay attention to what people do Sweet. and punish them really hard. But right now, speaking of punishing really hard, yeah, we got, we got Frogman. And Frogman rocking the Frogman the Fox, I believe. Yeah, yeah. And two, two Saints the Puff. Yeah, two Saints rocking the Puff. So we're talking about hard punishes. This Fox could die off one grab right now. <laughs> but for some. Godforsaken reason, they somehow went to Dreamland game yeah, one. Yeah, that's um. That is a large misstep on bold. the part of on the part of Frogman. That is a. I don't know. I don't think it's as clear cut as that because because Fox can camp out Jigglypuff on Dreamland just because of how big it is. Like there's so much space for there's a lot Fox of room to, to run. run away. Like it's it's not like Fod, you know, where like Fod has the high ceiling so Jigs lives, but also is like narrow enough that it's easier to corner Fox. Yikes! And quick get by two Saint. Frogman is stock down. So. Really? Nice. Hussein's looking pretty zombie-like right now. Maybe he needs food or something. Yeah, huh? I know. I, I know. I need oh. food. <laughs> Come out. Danger. <laughs> All right, Jigglypuff yeah. in danger percent. Yeah, you see the box. He's he is he is sniffing for some up smash right now. He is yeah. He's, he's not letting up. He's he's keeping two Saint in that corner. Oh wow. Nice. That looked like bad di. I don't yeah. think he should have died at 112 from there. But it's still good good ooh. pressure from uh, Frogman. Beady, him in the corner. pound on the, on the wake up, on the tech. Ooh. Oh, okay. Got him with the back air. Got him off stage. Yep. Oh, He's gonna be able to that's got to be a dead fox. Yep. That's a dead fox. Yeah, you can't, you, can't, you can't go off stage in this game. <laughs> you just you can't even like cross the line. Yeah, un unless your name is Peach Puff or Samus, <laughs> you should not be off stage for any reason in any Well, matchup. unless you're shine spiking someone. No, I mean like... You, you shouldn't be the one off stage while the other guy's oh, on stage. Oh, okay, like, I see. Like, pr pretty much my belief that, like, aside from those three characters yeah. and Marth in very specific matchups, anytime you go off stage, you should probably die. Anytime I, you I get knocked off stage, it. yeah, it should usually be the end of your stock. Marth sometimes and Fox if they don't go out to hit the Fire Fox. Yeah, yeah. If you give them, well, like, three angles. Well, because you can Fire Fox out of range. Yeah, and then you have like three angles. You can go straight into the stage, you can go up forward to the stage, or you can go like down forward to the ledge. Yeah. But even then, Ooh. you can do stuff like that. Nice, nice capitalization by Two Saint there. Oh, got him again. That's a wrap. Ooh, oh, not snap. quite. I don't know why he went for the down air there, but. Just a little bit of Look, looking a little bit less crisp than usual. Bear to forward smash. Oh wow. He trying, is, to he is trying to style. He is trying to style. He is trying to flex on this dude right oh, now. Oh boy. I, he went off he knew he was off stage when he started that It was a off. little it was a little bold. Alright, alright, all right, he's going he's going if back he to the got basics. it, it'd be amazing, but he's it like go, wasn't even close. <laughs> Oh, blip blips. Uh, oh, ooh, ooh, slick movement. All right. Oh, blip, blip. Oh, okay. Frogman showing some signs of life. He doesn't. He doesn't enjoy being disrespected like that. He's trying to. It, it was a slick way fire back into him. That's the okay. bet. Like, like when your opponent tries to flex like that and you punish him with the whole game. Yeah, but uh, he's still body combo. To go. The the infamous taunt to get body combo. It's a, it's <laughs> a, a, a very the S fat right. It's a very it's a variation variant of that combo. Yeah. <laughs> Try to swag it by. Oh, oh! He was looking for that up smash. Yeah, I, I thought he was gonna. He, it looked like he was looking for like a jump away. I think he, he was looking. Just fell away. Either that, or he was waiting for him to drop shield so he could turn around and hit him, but he didn't. Yeah, he just didn't get the response that he was looking for, so yeah. he pulled the trigger, which is probably a good idea. It is a really good idea. Usually people pull the trigger anyway. Oh, no. oh that's rough. What was that reverse back air? Yeah. Yikes. Yo, Frog! 
Ah, he can't hear me. <laughs> anyway, once again, this is uh, AGN STR Kid Goggles coming at you with his commentary for Rumble in the Tundra, and I am here with my good friend. <laughs> great him. Great him. Close enough. <laughs> Yo, let, let me be great him, man. <laughs> Where are you from, by the way? Rochester, homie. We go to the same RIT bi weekly all the time. Do you come to my tournaments? Do you come to Smash It Out? Nah, I don't. That's why you're irrelevant. Yeah. I'm a PM player, so. Oh, yeah. uh, I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Make sure he uh, eats food. It's very important. I'm going to be getting some food soon because I'm going to need it because I'm going to be playing two different tournaments at the same time. This is going to be fun. We've got but an extra sandwich if you want it. Nah, I got pizza in my car. I just need to find the time to go get it. Mmm. Alright, so Frogman going to FD. Going to FD. Doesn't like. He, he seems to be confident in his horizontal spacing. Yeah, he did. Uh, that's probably why they were on Dreamland. Because unless you unless you have a chain grab, that's pretty much what you're what you're gunning for when you pick Final Destination on someone. You're you're confident in your ability to weave in and out horizontally specifically without the added third dimension that is brought into the effect by platforms. That and with without the platforms, it is so easy for Fox to juggle jigs here. It's really hard for jigs to get back to stage if the fox is, uh, you know, sharking properly. Uh-oh. All right. Is, yep, yep. That's one of the, this is that up smash percent. This is that, that <laughs> sneaky, <laughs> that sneaky, you're only at 80, but you might forget that you're puff and get caught by this up smash and die. Okay. Nice. Okay. Gets the, gets the punch back out of shield. Ooh. Yeah. The held, spawns to the back of the wall. I would have backed up and given him a little ground, but Frogman was confident in holding it was the good. ground. It was a good call out. All right, we see him giving up the center stage there and yeah. letting himself get forced into a corner, and it looks like he just paid for it. Yeah. The one thing I've noticed about Tuesday is that he, his back airs are very solid. He has, as far at least in this match so far, little to no grab game whatsoever. Yeah. Yeah, like, he's, he's reaching with dash grab, doesn't even jump cancel. Like, he needs to work on that. But he is still rocking the advantage over Frogman. He has the game up. He's losing this stock, though. Oh, wait. Yeah, just, he went I for mean, the rest. percent doesn't count that much in this. Yeah, yep. got the in this matchup. <laughs> That's surprisingly hard to DI do. When you're just watching yeah. Melee, you're like, oh, I can't believe they didn't get the DI on that. But, like, wow, it's, oh, yep. my goodness. Yep, kill him, kill him, kill him. You can make it. You can make Ooh. it. Yep. Got it. <laughs> but, yeah, that still a good trade on stocks because now a he's, very uh, he's good got, a full, for two got a full stock up. What was an even game is now handily in his favor. Yep. So yeah, okay, but Frogman knows what he needs Shooting to do. Some he, is, he is sticking to the game plan. He knows. I think he needs to uh, be a little more aggressive about like holding the stage. He's letting himself get forced into a corner too often because he wants to run away and shoot lasers. But he's giving up not, too much ground. Can you not let the Jigglypuff pound four times in your face? Like, yeah. Yo, go punish that. There's a uh, there's end lag to that, homie. I don't know if you noticed. Yeah, let him have a little too much ground. He's trying not. He's moving away from the puff in the air so as to not get back aired. Yeah. He kind of probably should be going under. Yeah. He's gonna have to try and get the up smash. And Yikes! Two Saint takes it with a quick two stock for the two.